dog can be trained at any age. Many years ago, I rescued this Pomeranian out of the shelter. She was six years old. This dog did not know her name. She was not housebroken. She knew nothing. She did a lot of winning, but three years later, she actually finished her obedience trial championship. Training is more about listening to the dog than it is about issuing commands and orders. It's got to go both ways. And if, when the dogs feel that you're listening to them, they're much more willing to talk to you and to work for you. I view each new dog and each new breed as a new language and training is all about communicating to the animal what you want them to do. And the fun is trying to communicate to all different breeds because they have been bred for different purposes and they have different ways of thinking about things. I mean, some of your field dogs are very in tune with hand signals. When I started doing hand signals with the Pomeranian, she had no idea what I was doing. I think she thought I was swatting flies. So it meant nothing to her. So I had to come up with methods to explain to her that the hands had meaning. So each new dog presents a whole new way of training. And, and that's why I've learned over the years so many different ways to teach the same thing, because I've had to teach it to so many different breeds. My basic philosophy on training is that dogs, not unlike people, learn by trial and error. And so I have always been very willing to allow dogs to make mistakes. I think they learn from their mistakes as long as that there's no penalty for being wrong. The more they're wrong, the more they learn what right is. I never tell a dog what not to do. It's like sending you to the supermarket with a shopping list of everything you shouldn't buy. Okay, it's going to take you a long time to shop. So by ignoring the things that they do that I don't want and reinforcing the things that they do that that I want, they very quickly start doing things that I want and they're not nervous about making mistakes. If you have a dog that is afraid to make a mistake, this, this fear of failure gets in the way of learning. Any kind of training is going to improve the dog's ability to think, interact, and understand what's expected of him. So I don't really care what people teach their dogs to do, but teach them something.